Silver to fly the CT-114 Tudor aircraft. The Royal Canadian Air Force is on parade to receive new colors. And Master Warrant Officer Kimberly Jones is excited to be here. I sort of dedicated my uh, life to, uh, to the Air Force and uh, to be able to represent not only uh, Indigenous uh, members of the Canadian Armed Forces, but to be here on parade on uh, uh, Air Force Day is uh, quite an honour. The Eagle Staff represents all the Aboriginal people who serve the Canadian Armed Forces. The ones who served, the ones who are serving, and the ones who will serve. Jones's family is from the Shishigani First Nation in Ontario and she is one of a handful of officers who have received teachings to carry the Eagle Staff. It's an extreme honour to be the one um, chosen out of all of the Eagle Staff carriers throughout the Canadian Forces um, to be able to be here today. Colours refer to the consecrated ceremonial flags carried by certain Canadian Armed Forces combat units. It's only the third time in the Air Force's history new colours have been received. For most people in the Air Force, the colors represent our heritage, our history, the pride in what we do. Master Warrant Officer Jones says that working in the Armed Forces has been a rewarding career for her. The Air Force and the Canadian Armed Forces have given me uh, great opportunities um, to travel, to, to, to do things that I, the trade that I love. She has also carried the Eagle Staff at the Vimy Ridge celebrations earlier this year. There are over 2,400 Indigenous people serving in the Canadian Armed Forces. Beverly Andrews, APTN National News, Toronto.